everyone to the channel we are today playing some beautiful skyblock i am showcasing you the beautiful update of what we have in skyblock we have beautiful potatoes they look like this in your hand you can make you can make potato salad which is what i'm gonna make i'm gonna make potato salad i'm just gonna need to go down and grab some tomatoes from my as you very well know where i have my uh, farm but first i need to go down so let me grab tomatoes they are not over there they're actually all the way over here it's very good we need a few tomatoes so we can make beautiful stuff uh, so first like I said is the potatoes I would like to take a look at and then we're taking a look at the other stuff which is a few blocks and uh, a couple of things so potato salad is what you can do for for every three potatoes and one tomato you make one potato salad let's see how many I can actually do well I can do more than ten but uh, we'll do ten let me do ten for now so I could do fourteen potato salads apparently people eat this it says yeah people eat these too. I used to like them but I don't anymore. <laughs> Maybe I got fed up of him, I guess. I don't know. But uh, that's the potato salad. They look like that. They heal you, basically. I don't know how much, because I haven't taken damage. But uh, uh, yes, there's changes. I have two game, game Pass benches here. Also, but also, I wanted to say, the uh, show is... There's new blocks. There's mossy stone brick, which just looks like that. I don't have a tall grass and four bricks to do this. I would need to grab uh, that stuff. There's also stone brick slab, which for every one stone brick, you get one slab. You also have brick slab. You have, you, you have oak slab, maple slab, birch slab, and pine slab and also to go with the update if we take a look at the coloring station there's now option to also dye carpets because there's another new item it's called carpet it's 80 coins per one carpet so you're looking at 8k per 100 carpet which is not a bad deal if you ask me it's a really good deal and um, this carpet is really useful and an update to the flora bench as well because the flora bench didn't used to have the uh, maple hedges I believe and the flower pots but now it does so that is a really nice great update and of course you have your lighting stations which has candles and all that that's nothing new but the main new things I've just shown as well as potatoes and the potato totems uh, I forgot the price of the potato totems but I believe they are 5.5k if I'm not wrong Let's just take a look at the totem shop guy. Yeah, there they are, 5.5k. Now you probably say, why did I make a potato farm? They're they're trash. They sell one one potato sells for ten. I'm like, yeah, the trash. But I like to have one farm of everything. Like I'm I'm that type of I'm that one guy that does that. Yeah, you're gonna have to learn to live with that with me. <laughs> uh, nothing new in the bank. They also these NPCs, by the way. If you remember how they looked before, you'll see they have different clothing. It's pretty cool. Uh, I don't think there's anything new with the adventurer, but I can't remember. Nah, he's the same old, same old dude. Danson has joined. He's a friend of mine. He helps me here. Danson is a very good friend. Along with everyone else in this server. Don't we all love Danson? And cute boy, and the kind bro, and and then KTMM1, who is my one great uh, builder person who helps me build my place here. For some reason, there's a grass block here. I I, I don't know why, but uh, the update is basically what I've just shown. I forgot to show the carpet. Oh my god, I I forget the carpet. How dare I forget the carpet? It's him. Carpet is 80, per, like I said, 1 per eight, for 80 coins. 
So for a grand total of 100, you get 8k pricing. Now you might say that potatoes are shite, but the potatoes are potatoes. If you like potatoes, you will get them. Let me show you the pricing of these potatoes. 100 potatoes goes for 30k. Namely because 1 is 300 if I'm not wrong. Which is quite cheap to be honest. I, I like that. It's a good pricing to me. I personally enjoy having potatoes in my farm. Because it gives me more, not just decorative view, but it also gives... Uh, I'm looking for the word here. It gives... Um, more of a, a, a diverse, diversive field, farm field. Like, you don't just have the typical carrots, wheat, tomatoes, and onions. You also have potatoes and stuff like that, which is good to have. I hope they add more vegetables, because that is even more fun. What I do like about this update, as well, is I believe they managed to fix some... That I was gonna, just gonna say they managed to fix some lag issues, but then we get it. The server is so laggy. Uh, I don't know if that is something that because this used to be, that was an issue before how server was getting laggy over time. I think they fixed it, but it might be back. I don't know, but I think it's fixed, and uh, that's a good thing because we don't really lag, and uh, I don't like for sure, and. Uh, it's fun to play this game. There's blue flower growing in here. Awesome. We'll take it. An extra flower. So, what I need to do is gather a lot of blue flowers, basically. Because I am doing a lot of decorating. And it's taking its time. It really does. I also, I don't know if I showed you guys my berry farm, but uh, it's quite the larger one, isn't it? And it's now growing onto this side as well. It's going to be a large berry farm. I'm not gonna lie, I love it. I love all of my farms. That's not meant to be there. <laughs> so what I'm gonna do down here is I'm gonna add a brick stone cutter or a, a brick smelter. I mean, ugh, I'm not, I confuse these things because we need a brick. So I'm gonna do clay totem and smelt to get some bricks because we need some of that. So that's gonna be easy and fun. So I will be doing that off camera of course because what I'm doing today is just showing you the update stuff. So let me... And these blocks by the way, they look really nice. Like let's take a real good look at them again. And I don't think there was anything new here. They all look the same here. I think retextured model on the steel rod, but that's that. The game also has Xbox support, so Xbox people, you can play this game. So do it, it's worth a try. Oh, I forgot to mention there's coal block. That's a new item. I don't know if this smelts though, like, I want to craft one to see if it smelts. So I'm just gonna test this. I, I crafted a coal block. And um, I'm just gonna test. I wanna see if this works. It'll be really funny if. Um, okay. Uh, how can I work with this? What? Okay, we can't use the coal block, but at least you can use it to decorate, I guess, like a black wall or something if you needed that for any reason whatsoever but yeah uh, the cold blocks are quite useless at the moment so that is okay so while this this update might be to many a terrible update do know it's not a bad update it's a really good update in fact to uh, to the builders who play this game and are creative minded builders who like to build and make stuff then this update is perfect for you but if you're one of those who just likes to earn money and play the game because you want to be on the top then this update sucks for you but that's how that works yeah, I'm sorry but that is the truth and only the truth this is an update for the builders I for one thing is a really good one 
it provides great locks, it provides a lot of great op uh, opportunities to build amazing structures, like I've seen a few, few cool structures, I've seen some on videos that I've watched and I have to say they're really well made and I think these new blocks and carpets are gonna do even better with that so I would say we should be happy for this update. I know I might be repeating myself but it is what it is. Like come on, stained carpets, who does not like colored carpets, that is awesome. We get to use them in such ways that you ways that you didn't think you you'd be using them in, and uh, to be fair, that is great. Like you can make patterns and letters and things. But uh, enough of me for that. Thank you for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed as much as I did. I hope this was a short, informa informative update video where I just go over the update stuff, talk about them, and uh, how they basically do. So if you did watch all the way till now, thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Until then, make sure you are in my Discord server so you can join this beautiful VIP server. Make sure you are, indeed, in my Discord server because not only do we have a beautiful community there, we have great staff. Staff who is nice and helpful. So do join us, and let's just have fun in Discord, right? And let's have some fun on Roblox, and Minecraft for that matter, because I'll play either game. And I will be doing some Minecraft Dungeon content as well, because Minecraft Dungeon has dropped today. So you will see some Minecraft Dungeons, because I have that. So, thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Until then, goodbye!